U.S. sounds alarm over harmful Iran-Russia military partnership. The United States on Friday expressed alarm over a full-scale defense partnership between Russia and Iran, describing it as harmful to Ukraine, Iran's neighbors, and the world. Iran stands accused by Western powers of supplying drones to Russia for its war against Ukraine, as Moscow batters the country's energy infrastructure. Washington has previously condemned Iran-Russia's security cooperation, but on Friday described an extensive relationship involving equipment such as helicopters and fighter jets as well as drones, with the latter items resulting in new U.S. sanctions. Russia is seeking to collaborate with Iran in areas like weapons development, training, White House National Security Spokesman John Kirby told reporters. Moscow is offering Iran an unprecedented level of military and technical support that is transforming their relationship into a fully-fledged defense partnership, he said. We have also seen reports that Moscow and Tehran are considering the establishment of a joint production line for lethal drones in Russia. We urge Iran to reverse course and not to take these steps. Kirby said that the United States would sanction three Russian-based entities active in the acquisition and use of Iranian drones. The sanctions target the Russian Aerospace Forces, the 924th State Center for Unmanned Aviation, and the Command of the Military Transport Aviation. The United States will continue to use every tool at our disposal to disrupt these transfers and impose consequences on those engaged in this activity, Secretary of State Antony Blinken said in a statement on the sanctions. Last month, Tehran admitted it had sent drones to Russia, but insisted they were supplied before the invasion of Ukraine. Kirby said the United States is also concerned that Russia intends to provide Iran with advanced military components, including helicopters and air defense systems. Iranian pilots have reportedly been learning to fly advanced Sukhoi Su-35 warplanes in Russia, and Tehran may receive the aircraft within the next year, which would significantly strengthen Iran's air force relative to its regional neighbors, Kirby said. The United States also believes that Iran is considering the sale of hundreds of ballistic missiles to Russia, he said. Britain's Foreign Secretary James cleverly took aim Friday at the sordid deals between Moscow and Tehran, saying in a statement that Iran had sent drones to Russia in exchange for military and technical support from Moscow. This will increase the risk it poses to our partners in the Middle East and to international security, cleverly said, vowing that the UK will continue to expose this desperate alliance and hold both countries to account. Kirby on Friday announced a new $275 million aid package to help boost Ukraine's air defenses against Russian drones in particular. He said the aid will soon be on its way to provide Ukraine with new capabilities to boost its air defenses and counter the threats that Ukraine is facing from drones. The Pentagon released details on the package, saying it includes counter-drone equipment, as well as ammunition for Himars precision rocket systems, 80,155 mm artillery rounds, some 150 generators, and other equipment. The United States has previously said that generators were being provided to Kiev to help Ukraine with its electricity needs amid repeated Russian strikes on energy infrastructure. The latest package, which is made up of equipment taken from existing U.S. stocks, brings Washington's military assistance to Ukraine since Russia's February 24th invasion to more than $19.3 billion.